I actually went to uh, General Haig was on the Al Haig was on the board of MGM. We were making it, and they said, "You know, we have General Haig." And I said, "Oh, yeah, send me to Washington immediately." So he was the head of a think tank. So I spent two days with him, smoking Cuban cigars. And I said, General, hey, how can you smoke Cuban cigars if you hate Castro so much? He says, John, we're burning his crops to the ground. <laughs> and, and he and I discussed all the possible scenarios of how a third world war would start and what it would be and the idea of, and we went back to the old German idea of getting the Mexicans to help and that's how we sort of came up with the scenario of that. And, you know, I love things in Red Dawn, like the siege of Denver, <laughs> you know. You know, it's like, it's supposed to be like, you know, um, what do you call it, Leningrad, where they're all starving and everything, you know. But I love the, whenever he says, the siege of Denver. <laughs> Something about that's good, you know. There's half a million scarecrows in Denver would give anything one mouthful of what you got. They've been under siege for about three months. They live on rats and sawdust bread and sometimes on each other. Red Dawn's not a very violent movie compared to any kind of slasher movie or anything like that. It's just the rating board had it out for me. You know, and they looked at me as this, you know, fanatic right winger, you know, member of the NRA, you know, a, a potential threat to Western civilization, <laughs> you know, and so they wanted anything I did, and, and here was this movie that was clearly anti-communist, anti-Russian, which is strange because I am a communist, you know, and there's a side of me that's a Maoist. Get me talking about CEOs and, you know, private equity and stuff like that. I want show trials, executions. <laughs> uh, and, uh, Get me talking about, uh, you know, movie executives and bring the Maoist right out or the Writers Guild strike or something like that. You know.